there are many opportunities in God. I've had times in my life where I couldn't see opportunity, where I didn't see anything happening at all. And then I went into prayer, and within a short time, literally the cataracts were lifted from my eyes, the frozen cement was lifted from my mind, and I felt again and knew again and was energized again on the opportunities that were before me. Opportunities that I never would have seen without times of prayer. Opportunities are God-given, and they are good, and they are available to you. However, as you sense these opportunities, you must do your part. And what is your part? Your part is to act on those opportunities. As you become open, as you become receptive to what I like to call a divine leading, where God is guiding you, but more than that, almost pulling your hand and pulling you in a certain direction, sometimes in a direction that you don't want to go, and then you enter the light and the love of God. Through divine opportunities, you are led to your very highest good, just as surely as if you were following a compass in your pocket. But much better, this is a compass of God, a compass that has more directions than just north and south and east and west, directions that you haven't even thought of in your human mind. And you're led to the right direction for you to travel in, in your life. Opportunities for your highest good are always waiting your discovery, and the discovery is made in prayer. It opens you up again, it makes you aware again, and it makes you willing again. Through an awareness of God's power at work in and through you, you maintain a clear channel for the flow of divine good. Here's what I mean by that. I've had times in my life where I've had a closed-off mind. I knew what was best even if it wasn't working, and I knew it wasn't working. And then through prayer, I had a clear channel. I opened up again to a higher mind than my own. Now then, when you get to the other side of that, when you're free of your own self-imposed limitations, you're open and you're receptive to new ideas. And each new idea is an opportunity to be creative. It is the way that we must approach the rest of our lives. As we act on an idea, we can help bring into visibility the very good that is awaiting manifestation in our lives holding fast to the faith in God, even greater good will be added to that that we have already thankfully claimed. Sometimes it's given a little bit at a time so that we can comprehend it. Well, I pray today that this is the case for you. As it says in 2 Thessalonians 3, verse 5, May the Lord direct your hearts to the love of God and to the steadfastness of Christ. I pray that you have more opportunities in your life than you have ever had before. The daily, every day, is a day of discovery of God good.